Hey y'all, so let's talk about some piquette out of Slovenia. Um, so we have Sticks and Bugs, which is from Sanctum. And if you've been around for a while, we had a Pinot Noir from them a bit back. Um, that was also really lovely. So when I heard they had a piquette, we definitely wanted to grab some because um, it couldn't be more perfect timing for it. So um, these guys, like I said, they're out of Slovenia, I think from the Styria region. And um, piquette for a refresher is basically taking the grapes that have already been pressed, um, adding water to it, letting it sit for another couple of weeks, repressing it and letting it referment, um, which normally gives it a low ABV. This one says seven to 10 on the bottle. I'm pretty sure from the tasting notes, um, it's 8%, so pretty low. Uh, and it's mainly out of Chardonnay. So let's see what we think about. Um, the first thing I did notice when I initially opened it, which was um, a couple of days ago, actually, at this point, I'm trying to spread out my videos a bit more. And um, it is definitely fr uh, fizzy. It's not like, it's like the difference between um, like spumante and frizzante. It's frizzante. Spumante would be completely sparkling. Uh, spumante, or sorry, frizzante is this, so just slightly sparkling. Um, so on the nose, uh, I really get like light fruits, um, less so lemon. I get like a lot of like pear and maybe like a teensy bit of stone fruit. So let's try it. That is just light and fresh. Like that's why I love it for spring and for summer. Um, that pear is definitely still here. You get a little bit of like lime zest, but not a ton on it. Like this is a really simple, lovely um, version of a, of a uh, piquette. It does have like that yeastiness to it and that's not mouse, <laughs> but yeasty aftertaste, the funkiness. Um, and what was the last thing I wanted to say about it? Oh, I remember. Yeah, so um, definitely tastes more like a, uh, a piquette than a regular wine. Uh, and I would say that this is good for people that might uh, be like fans of sour beer. I'm actually honestly not a fan of sour beer, but I do love piquette. It's like halfway between like what a really intense sour beer tastes like, um, or sours, and uh, in like wine. So that's what I love about this. Like you could easily like to this demand to have like a picnic and be drank outside, super chilled, um, and you don't have to worry about super high ABV. So I hope you enjoy it.